In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to use the full width menu module. Now the menu module lets you take one of your menus that you have created in the appearances menus tab in your WordPress dashboard and place it anywhere on your page using the builder. For example, on this page, if I wanted to add a secondary menu down here, below our big splash image, I could do that. Or I could even disable our main menu on this page and uh, have our main menu appear somewhere down lower on the page. So here we have the builder representation of that page I was just showing you. Now let's say I want to add a new menu down below our main splash, pay, uh, splash header. I'm going to click the add full width section button and then click the insert module button and choose the full width menu. You can choose your background color. So if you want to change the background color to like a dark gray, you can choose your text color. Since I chose a dark background color, I'm going to want to ma make my text light. And you can choose which way your uh, text is oriented, left, center, or right. I'm going to keep it centered. And then you can choose your admin label, CSID, and CSS class, which I'll leave blank for now. So if we update this and take a look at our page, you can see that a new menu has been added down below. Now, you can also combine this with the blank page template feature to uh, remove your main header and use only this uh, menu module that we just added. So if you go down and look for the page attributes section when you're editing your page and look for the template drop down menu and choose blank page and then update. We've now removed the main header in favor of using only our secondary navigation that we created with the menu module. This is a great way to create uh, unique landing pages or unique home page. So you can keep your same menu that you'd usually have at the top, but just put it down lower on the page to give this main splash header uh, more prominence. And that's a basic overview of using the menu module.